Hello everybody, it's Chachuki, back with another Chachuki Views episode. Tonight, on the program, we are checking out Lucid, one of my games of PAX East this year. Let's get right into it. Hope everyone is having a good day today. If you're new to the channel, make sure to give us a thumbs up, share the video, subscribe, and, uh, favorite platformer? Down below in the comments. That's me! Let me just see here. Okay, um, audio. I played this at PAX East months ago. Or maybe a couple months ago, I don't remember. Lucky I know what day it is. Oh, and I'm a pleased to see you're maintaining your aura attunement regimen. Your father's glade is your father's glade is an excellent insight for meditation. A sacred place, brimming with aura. But I digress. I could use the assistance of an aspiring sentinel such as yourself. One of my junior sentinel students has left the gate to the flax pasture open, and all the crystal lawbacks have gone for an inconvenient walkabout. The zealous pupils have set forth in hopes to gather the herd. Would you be so kind to ensure both the children and the lawbacks are safe as you make your way back home? You may even learn something from the tutelage scrolls the lawbacks are chewing on. I'm just gonna lower that uh, sound effect a little bit. Jumping. Some ledges were carved into the landscape by sentinels of old to help a particularly difficult ascent. Oh, it's a guy. Houses for my kin, fashioned by our kind keeper. He protects us all. Enter the focus stance by holding trigger, then press left or right. The aura dash lets you use your increased momentum to jump higher. Rich Earth refills or dash. You've been 
go much faster, Owen. There really is no better way to travel than aura dashing. But be sure to keep an eye out for the Junior Sentinels and Los Lobex as you swiftly navigate the forest. I'll meet you up ahead, just past your and your father's home. The glade you frequent, no home without the holder, secret light and shade. Oh, I miss this guy. Old friend and father, kindle the path home for us. Wandering no more. Note from Hall. Owen, I've gone, I've gone ahead to the Sentinel Temple to begin preparations for the cleansing. You've shown a newfound focus and mastery of your studies. Your aura rendering is strong. Come meet me at the temple. I believe you are ready to take the next step in becoming a true Sentinel. I've left you something at our prayer shrine to commemorate the occasion. An old Sentinel heirloom gifted to me for a long time ago. P.S. Be sure to rest at the Altar of Attunement before you head out to save your progress. Jagarabu Syrup, a traditional sense of treat. Burnt again. I have the power! You have learned your first crystal art. The crystal blade. Perform the crystal blade with that. Use it well, and always remember the words of the Sentinel Law of Ingenuity. Carve your own path through the world. Okay, we don't have any... We don't have any, uh, crystal arts yet. Do 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 I see Hall has entrusted you with your first memory crystal, and not a moment too soon. The way back to camp has become quite treacherous. The flame's per pervasive nature has found its way to our hidden and protective province, causing the aura of our woodland creatures to seethe. Proceed with care, Owen. Okay. Pulse walls can be destroyed with a few simple aura pulses, but, more, but often more sturdy walls require more powerful abilities. The crystal blade, frequented by many within the Sentinel Orders, is capable of destroying sturdy cracked walls. The blade can also perform a three-hit combo. Simply tap A uh, up or Y because I'm using an Xbox 360 controller uh, during the current slash to continue the combo. Great for destroying those pesky red walls. The petrified forest has been extra spooky today. Danger seems to be waiting in every gully. Our master Tom also always says, Make it a habit to look before you leap. Tilt the stick up to look up or down. What? Who, who me? I'm not going down there. Oh look, but I'm not gonna leap. What are you, what are you frickin' nuts?
quality leather. Bring this material to a tailor smith to craft new equipment. Oh yeah! Crystal blade while airborne to perform the air blade. All crystal arts have two air charges. By hitting a strikeable object, you replenish one jump and one air charge. This will allow you to stay airborne. Piggle de piggle! I don't know what that's supposed to be. Sentinels often use crystal lanterns as footholds. I'm stuck. I have a master my crystal slash climb. Maybe you could get up there. Use your air slash to get this red crystal wall to refresh your jump and wall climb your way up there. Master Tomos is out looking for us students. I'll make my way back to him and return to camp. Oh, and Owen, could you maybe uh, keep my crystal slash issues between us? I don't want people to know I have uh, cr uh, Chris Red. Crystectile uh, deficiency. Now, I believe this is the Kickstarter build, so I'm not sure how far this goes. Use Crystal Arts to strike through aura walls. Whenever health lanterns are struck, they emit a ring to rejuvenate of rejuvenating aura. Pass through this aura to refill your health. Enemies can be included in crystal art chaining. Be mindful of your surroundings. Hmm. I thought for sure I'd find the children here taking a well-deserved break, as they so often put it. Those mischief-making junior sentinels have been attempting to complete this reward chain for some time now, Owen. Think, as a, think an aspiring true sentinel, air quotes, such as yourself, can complete what they have not. Hit the crystal lantern to advance it towards its destination. Don't forget, take too long and the crystal lantern will start to slip. Or a slab. Wonderfully done, Owen. I had no doubt in my old student. I thought you'd sound like an old man. Do not, per, do not, uh, patronize me. Yes, that is the word. Even though we live underground, you know, I know how to zing you after all. I screwed that up. Okay. I'm calling him Owen, even if that's not how you pronounce his name. Can't get that yet, because I can't up-dash. 
can't end this way, Owen. <sighs> Curl? Nothing down there but a dumb locked key. Fat chance anybody can figure out how to lock it. Holding up or down during the blade combo will modify the final strike. Hold up to finish with a, da a blade dash blade. Useful for repositioning in battle. Hold down to send forth a blade projectile. Health or Knowing how many jumps you have left is often the difference between successfully reaching the summit and falling to certain doom! Pay attention to your body. The aura within you will diminish when you've exhausted your jumps. Master's tip! Repeatedly strike a target without jumping to replenish your resources to full. I'm going. I'm not afraid of heights. I'm just. I'm not afraid of heights. I'm not afraid of heights. I'm not afraid of heights. Ah, Owen. I knew I could count on holes, boy. Thank you for ensuring the safety of our order's invaluable crystal lobexes. Oh, and yeah, the children too, yeah, of course, of course, the uh, children, natural resources. Hold down and jump to fall through platforms. Okay, that oh, um... Use your aura pulse to send a small amount of condensed aura hurling forward. These projectiles are perfect. Ha! <laughs> Stinking lock gates! They'll only open if all of their crystal lanterns are purified. Fire ore pulses into the sky. 
You can aim aura pulses at 45 degree angles. This is particularly helpful when you need to clear a path of ill-placed enemies. Ooh, Sentinel Iron. Nice! That's some helpful stuff right there. certain enemies, the aura within them will accumulate, resulting in a guard break. While afflicted with guard break, foes will become immobilized and take additional damage, making for the perfect time to dash in and deal massive damage. Oh, and I need some help taking down a Sentinel Watcher up ahead. Pay attention to what attacks produce an invulnerable sound. It'll help you when you need to uh, use your oracles. When you use your crystal hearts. Good luck going! If you need to recover some health, hold down while in the focus stance to use an aura charge. You can refill aura charges by damaging enemies. Looking motivated today, Owen. How do I teach my boys how to have drive like yours? All they do is wander the petrified forest getting into trouble. Do you think this is a good spot for a new house? Hmm. The petrified forest is going to make getting these building materials difficult. Crystal flame has been growing at an alarming rate. Hey, no problem, peaches. Little Sentinel, I'm working on making you a codex as we speak. No longer all the places you will go, beasts you will see, and people you will meet. It'll be glorious. I'm working as fast and as hard as I can, but I don't think I will have it ready in this build. Ow! Oh! <laughs> Blacksmith. Owen! I just finished my latest bracer design. My best yet. One that no sentinel should be without. Do yourself a favor. Purchase your first bracer so you can equip talismans. My advice is free, but my tailoring expertise will cost you. Crystal arts gain an additional air charge. The bear deals and receives double... No. 
Increases defense. Super saturated crystalline aura. If you need the best, you know where to find me. Blood. Your pops just passed through here. He said he was on his way to the Sentinel Temple. You mean him then? If so, stay alert on your trek, young blood. Something about the petrified forest feels off. But don't fret, you can follow the cairns I built. They will take you straight to the temple. As our camp's resident herald, it is my duty to trek the path after all. If you find yourself lost, take a look at your reverie map in the pause. We have a map? Wait a minute. Oh, uh, okay, thanks. That would have been nice. Oh, hi, Owen. Huh? Our friend the scribe says he can understand what these coda are saying. No matter how hard I try, all I hear is their coda song. Oh, a pig and a rabbit. <laughs> how can anyone not love a pigus? Just look how they squeeze. Oh, and can you please tell my sister how much Kira Bun Bun is compared to a smelly old pigus? I'm not getting involved. I bet you can't find my secret hiding place. I'll even give you a hand. This location would blow you away. You'll still never find it, Owen. If you could keep going this way, you'd reach the camp's Crystal Lobex pasture and Junior Sentinel grounds. Too bad she's not ready yet. Oh, before you leave camp, I believe Sid was looking for you. I'm sure you'll find our young Taylor Smith at the tailor shop. Hard to find her anywhere else. Go on now, get to it. I'm glad you can't go further. I don't want to sit through any more Junior Sentinel lessons. <laughs> the Lobex creeped me out. The vacant stairs pierced my soul. What are they looking at? Oh. Can, can I move the map now? Okay. Oh. Corrosive red flame disrupts, corrupts, and obstructs. Time, place, time, and... Alright, let's go meet my dad. Let's go meet my dad! Okay. Let's see. Crystal Arts gain an additional air. Increased defense, I think. Increased defense. I think increased defense is good for now. Man, what am I in a traffic pattern? It's the second second thing I've done that has airplanes flying all around.
forgot that was a thing. Bountiful Talisman. Yes, extra defense will be beneficial for us. Ooh, shortcut. How I got up here. Stupid ceiling over there stopped me in my tracks. If only I could use crystal slash upwards, which I can't do yet. Can't slash up yet, so that in the way is no good. To incapacitate sentinel turrets inflicted by flame strike. Uh, wait, to incapacitate sentinel turrets inflicted by flame, sh flame strike them with a the crystal art. Secret platform. Flame kissed ore. Oh, yeah. Here. Beware of Bomba Bite. Secret, I'll tell you a technique Master Tabo showed me. If you ever want to slow your descent, you can slide down walls by wall clinging.
clone talisman. Is my mouse. Right. Uh, I've been off more than I could chew. I came out here to try and complete that advanced reward chain. I want the proof to curl. I'm not a freaky. Or. Or molder. Maybe I could try it. Show me, Owen.
Go up that way. the temple. I guess I took that out that you could uh, try and Mega Man X your way up the wall. Talisman. Talisman allows the wearer to shed a crystal clone that will explode. I gotta make sure I didn't just take off my defense. So long, my boy. Oh my gosh, not a one of Tomos' students forgot to close the pasture gate. <laughs> this old temple could use a thorough cleansing. The aura within these ancient halls reek of flame, causing many of our old sentinel mechanisms to malfunction. Snuff out the flame before it spreads too deep, my boy. circuit? Not yet. Yeah, I guess so. Okay.
learned a new crystal art. Crystal speaker. Your secondary crystal art is mapped to the uh, B button. I think I'm actually going to call it here. Uh, if you're, this has been uh, Lucid, uh, my game, one of my games of PAX East this year. Um, if you're new to the channel, make sure to give us a thumbs up, share the video, subscribe, and uh, favorite Metroidvania. I don't, rem I don't think that's what I said before, but uh, that's going to do it for this. My name is Steve. We will see you in the next one. Later.